So what are the issues with confidential computing in the cloud? The issues with confidential computing is that on one hand, you want to create an aggregation of data from multiple organizations. So you want multiple organizations to put data in, but you don't want them to be able to see data coming out. And this type of filtered access to the data is not very cloud friendly. In addition, you have the actual modeling, the AI software, the neural network running, and all of the big data analysis, which is actually very valuable programming, which is running on this data, but you want to actually protect that network from the organizations putting the data in. And all of this cross protection and different analysis that comes out creates a very, very difficult configuration for the cloud or for the, the firewall slash HSM slash um, com general computing that is done today. And so we've actually partnered with a large um, networking company in the USA. And we're going to be deploying a secure multi-party machine based on our architecture, which is, a, is an excellent environment for uh, confidential computing. So each, each company, as we said, we have multiple cores. So each company gets their own core in the vault or their own set of cores in the vault. And they can determine the policy and the rules for the data that they specifically put in their core. So they can manage their own rules. So, you know, data from company A can have its rules, data from company B can have its rules, data from company C can have its rules. And, this, and these rules protect their own data and can be set independently. In addition, there can be the AI application can also be protected by its own set of rules. And also the secure modeling and analysis can be protected. And therefore you get an environment which can be scaled to support large computational loads, but yet has complete controlled access for all the people providing information into the system. And of course, the hackers are kept out due to the secure firewall uh, um, filtering um, done on the system itself. Um, as we say here, this um, is, uh, provides protection in the cloud. I might say it also provides protection from us. The thing about cloud data is that in many cases, the people who work for the cloud company or the people who operate the computers in the cloud company can see the data. In the case of hub security, nobody in our company has access to any of this data. These uh, platforms are even secure from ourselves. Uh, the AI application is protected separately from the data, which is a unique um, element. And in the future, we will be deploying homomorphic encryption on cores designed especially for homomorphic encryption. So one word about homomorphic encryption, I'll answer more later in questions. Homomorphic encryption allows you to manipulate data in its encrypted form. In most cases, data is encrypted, then it's decrypted for manipulation, and then re-encrypted. And homomorphic encryption allows you to do the manipulation on data in its encrypted form, and this needs specific um, support from hardware in order to be done efficiently. 